What are the following materials do you need to cook? What? Fish. Sugar. What? Fish and sugar, I think. What the fuck? Welcome back, YouTube. Today's video is the hardest Genshin Impact quiz ever. And I know this because I had my mods try to do it too, and they got angry. They raged. And so I was like, that's perfect content. I want to do that for a video. And of course, we have to have a twist to it. If I score above 80%, I'll give away five $15 Primo Gem bundles. But if I score below 80%, 10 of them live on Twitch, which by the way, I stream live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Dora44 if you want to check us out. All right, this is called the ultimate Genjin Impact Trivia Test. I will also have this link in my description below if you want to try it out for yourself and let me know in the comments your score. This quiz covers a range of Genjin Impact based knowledge questions created by pro gamers of Genjin Impact. This quiz is perfect for you if you want to test your knowledge from character skills, gameplay tactics to the things that you usually see during exploration and grinding. <laughs> This is, I grind every day, dude. This is gonna be easy. Who is the character that invented Leeway Millennial? What the fuck is a Leeway Millennial? <laughs> oh no! Hmm. Well, Ning Guang is like the boss of everything, right? So naturally, probably Ning Guang, right? It doesn't tell me? Uh, <laughs> no, it doesn't tell me. We'll find out in the end how much money I owe. <laughs> Who was the person that wrote to that travel guide? That's easy. It's Alice. Oh my God. I don't use Amber. No one uses Amber other than Rin Tai Chow, who is crazy, by the way. Calling steel names belong to Amber. Okay. Fiery Rain. That sounds like what her ultimate would do. Explosive Puppet. I mean, that also sounds like like Baron Bunny's like thing. Celine Dion once said, my heart will go on and my heart is going on to fiery rain. Wait, what? You can click multiples of <laughs> I also want to say burning shot. Just go with my heart. My heart will go on. Those two. Done. Next question. Easy. Come on. What is the correct character banner history from version two? I should know this. I started in 1.5 and I have every banner memorized, obviously. I want to say Raiden and Coco. Wait, no. Dude, that is the fucking hardest question in the world. You have to put all of these in the correct order. <laughs> Can we just stop chat? Can we just, just stop maybe? If we stop now, I don't think anyone would, uh, I don't think anyone would blame me, right? So you'd probably want to start off with like a weaker, like, you know, banner like Eula, Albedo, and Ido. A Why is it a trouble banner? Eh, you know, like they're good, but like, you know, the better ones coming, you know? So then you would want to be like, okay, we had a low banner. So now we want to get like a bang, like a banger banner. So then you'd probably go like Ayaka and Yoimiya. Now, who would be perfect with Ayaka, but we're not going to run her with Ayaka? Shenha. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, right? You're going to do that. Now you're going to be like, all right, bring out the big guns right now, Raiden and Coco. And then you're like, all right, we've made our money. Uh, put out Tartali and Hutao, you know, it'll make some money. Done. Next question. I think we got that. <laughs> all right. When is Kujo Sora's birthday? F me. What kind of sign she gives? You know, is she a Taurus, a Gemini? Looking at her, she gives me like March birthday. I'm gonna do March. Zhongli's passive talent resonant waves can provide how many fortify stacks? What sorcery is this? Five. Five stacks. Which characters are needed to form the Sunfire team comp? That's easy. I know this one. I've done that before. Gene and Bennett. With zero stacks, how many points of stamina does Ito's charge attack cons- How the f do I know that? Zero stamina. Carry the two. Minus pi. Divide state of Montana with access to 20. Easy. What do the following characters' constellations reset their skill cooldown? Kazua. I know that. Tartal. Tartalias doesn't reset it, though. Unless Tartalia has one that it does reset it. You know what? I'm going to follow my gut. My my big gut Tartalia. I, I bet, like, I know his C1 reduces the cooldown, but maybe one of his later ones actually, like, resets it, maybe? I don't know. I'm going to go with my gut. And I also want to say Yaimiko, dude, for some reason. Done. Next question. What will four set gambler artifact do to your character? <laughs> do what? 
I don't know. I've never used this one. Defeating an opponent has 100% chance to remove elemental skill cooldown. It can only occur once every fin. Doesn't really sound like gambling to me because there's never 100% shot in gambling. Eh, out. Gaining elemental particles or orbs gives three energy to all party members who have a bow or catalyst equipped. It can only occur once every three seconds. That doesn't sound like gambling to me either. That sounds more like a guarantee. Eh, out. Okay, none of these have anything to do with gambling. So why is this called the gambler set? I'm feeling like it's this one. So I'm gonna go with that one. What is the hotel in Mondstadt? There's a hotel in Mondstadt? Morning Breeze Hotel. The city of Mondstadt is also referred as City of Freedom? City of Gliding? Done. Next question. Which one of these tribes belongs to the Hilicho tribe in Dadaupa Gorge? Who knows this? No one knows this. I think Eclipse Tribe. I'm going to say Eclipse Tribe. What is the Wangshu insignia? Signature dish? It's either jade parcels or almond tofu. And I kind of want to say almond tofu. You know what? I'm going to turn to chat. Only one question. Chat, what is it? Is it almond tofu? That's what I was thinking. I, I was thinking almond tofu as well. Okay, now I can't I can't get a lifeline anymore. Okay, we're almost done. I feel like we're like a little bit over halfway. What is the name of the cat that we seek in Gene's story quest, Leo Minor chapter? What? What? I don't remember. Is it Prince? I think it's Prince. Which of the following items will not be obtained from Mommy Raiden with multiple hands boss fight? Dude, I suck at questions that are like, what do you not get? What do you not not get if you do not get this? You're trying to confuse me with a knot, dude. I'm like a second grader. I can't read. I'm going to say meaning of aeons. Sort this talent book based on their domain schedule. What the f***? I don't freaking know. Freedom, my nuts. Ballad, my nuts. Resistance, my nuts. I think that was right. I, dude, I'm really curious as to see what my percentage of knowledge is going to be, dude. What are the following characters do not need Ashtaha Weekly Bot? You're confusing me with the not. Eula does not. I also feel like Shao does not. Wait, maybe Eula does need Ashtaha Drops. I think I got it. Which domain do you need to enter to farm wine and songs ascension? My wine and song is at level zero right now, I think. So I have never done this. But I'm gonna try to pretend that I know. Make myself look smarter. Cecilia Garden. I could see myself definitely drinking wine on a nice breezy day. I don't really see myself going to a forsaken rift with wine and song. I'm gonna say Cecilia Garden. Easy. Okay. How many masks of Kajin do you need to fully ascend the catch? Can I admit something to you? My catch is still at level 50, 640. So I don't know. I'm going to say, because of the gold one, right? 15. What buff will your team get if you consumed berry and mint burst? That one sounds more like an attack buff. So I'm going to do attack buff. What are the following materials do you need to cook? What? Fish. Sugar. What? Fish and sugar, I think. What the fuck? Uh, I'm going to say rice as well. Easy. Okay, we're almost done, chat. We're in the home stretch. I think a couple more. Take guesses in chat what you think my percentage is going to be. What are the following materials do you need to craft a heat shield potion? I'm going to be 100 million percent honest with you. I've been playing this game for three years, and uh, I always forget that you can make potions in the game. I'm going to say Miss Flower Corolla. I drove a 2009 Corolla before I upgraded my car. I am going to say Corolla because that's more resonant with me. You know, that car was fire. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I see what I did there. Okay, what if the following statements are correct? Moon pie is a special dish you can cook from Eula. Yes, I do know that because she has a gigantic moon pie. You need a specific local specialty ingredient, dandelion seed, to craft wind barrier potion. That sounds right. You know, I read that with confidence, so I'm gonna say yes. You need salt and fish to cook all weather beauty. Is it bad that these all sound right? I wanna say this one's right as well, but in the same time, I'm gonna click it though. Okay, chat, this is our last question of the hardest Genshin Impact quiz 
ever. What are the following materials do you need to craft a depth eye seeker stove gadget? Now, I've been pretty confident, I would say. I think I'm at around a 99, 98, not, let's be generous, 97% right now. So we can afford to get this wrong. I'm going to say white eye. I was gonna say that one. Wait, what's my percentage? Your total score is 180 and your scores is in each. You told me the wrong thing. Use math. I'm a streamer. I don't know math. So each section is a percentage. So I got a 40% on characters, 60% on combat, 40% on exploration, and a 20 in a domain. <laughs> Jesus Christ, and a 20 in material. So what would that be average wise? It's 36, 36%? 36 <laughs> oh my God, 36%. Uh, looking at it from a different point of view, 36% is not that bad when you think about it. Because if you think about it, it could have been 35%. Could have been lower. And you're almost to 50%. You're almost a halfway. So it's not all that bad, you know? That quiz was so stupidly hard, dude. I didn't realize it was going to be that freaking hard. Okay, chat. So that means we're going to be giving away $10, $15 Primo Gem bundles today if you're watching this on youtube i hope you enjoyed my pain and my suffering let me know in the comments down below if you were following along and what quiz score you got and don't lie okay because 36 percent is not that bad and if you got above 36 percent, you're cheating i think because th this question these questions are really hard let me know in the comments down below as well if you want to see more stupid quizzes and challenges like this and uh well pray for my wallet have a great one bye <laughs>